Hi there, it's Gabriella Rosa here and I thought today I would show you in my own kitchen, so welcome, how to make the whole lemon drink. I know that it's one of the highlights of the 14 day fertility challenge and everyone loves the process. I mean, I know that I do and I certainly love to watch the process of everyone, you know, getting to their end results. So I thought, why not come and show you a little bit about how it actually is made. Now, the whole lemon drink is amazing for a whole lot of things, from detoxification to enhancing immune function and liver health to assisting hormonal balance. And of course, as you can read there, strengthening and improving cell membrane health. Of course, that will also help to improve digestion. So lots of wonderful benefits. I wanna share with you exactly how to make it. And we've got everything that we need here to make the whole lemon drink. So we've got the lemons, which I'm going to use. They're organic from my little lemon tree. And uh, we also have the water, one and a half cups of water. We have the lecithin, which is that brown powder right there. And, we, and with lecithin, make sure that you don't buy soy-based lecithin. You wanna make sure that you buy sunflower or ideally egg. Sometimes it's difficult to find egg, but really make sure that you are not using soy because it will negatively impact your hormonal balance. Okay, so sunflower lecithin will be the best thing to use. Today, I'm using coconut oil, we can, which you can use coconut butter or even fish oil. My preferred is fish oil. The only reason that I didn't is because I didn't have enough liquid fish oil in my fridge today. But essentially, the coconut oil is what we're using for it right now. The reason that I prefer the, the fish oil, the liquid fish oil, is because it helps to improve egg and sperm quality. Uh, there are some incredible benefits to coconut as well, but I do prefer, for fertility purposes, I do prefer the fish oil if you can bear it. Most of it doesn't taste bad, so don't worry, it actually gets hidden, the flavor gets hidden in the lemon drink anyway. You, do, you want the lemon drink to be a little bit bitter because that's what it helps to enhance the liver function, but that's essentially what you do with the oil. I've got two capsules of vitamin E here. These are 500 IU each, international units, and you want to use 1,000 uh, international units if you've never had rheumatic fever. So that's essentially what you're going to use. And a knob of ginger, and this knob of ginger is pretty large, about the size of a golf ball is what you're looking for. I've put in the water, we're putting in the lemons, putting in the, the uh, coconut oil, the lecithin powder. Then we're also going to be putting in, and I can hear little babies crying in the background, uh, we're also putting in the vitamin E capsules and the ginger, okay? All in one, <coughs> closing the lid, and we're going to actually blend this. The secret to this is that we wanna blend it for about two minutes, okay? The more you blend it, the less you actually have to strain the drink. So I would blend it you know, for two to three minutes and, uh, and that's gonna give us, I'm actually gonna set, oops, gonna set in here the um, two and a half minutes, see how we go. If we need to, we'll put it for another half a, half a minute and we'll go from there. <laughs> So it's been two and a half minutes. We're gonna open it up and just check how it's going. It looks actually pretty brilliant, if I say so myself. It doesn't look like it needs any straining. If you have a look, it's very smooth, right there. And that is how you make this wonderful elixir, the whole lemon drink. Cheers.